The Third Street Bridge, also known as the Lefty O Dual Bridge, is located near AT&T Park. It carries thousands of vehicles, pedestrians, and bicyclists over Mission Creek Channel every day. We at Public Works are proud to be the caretakers of this classic drawbridge, keeping it in great shape while raising and lowering it for seagoing vessels. In today's episode of Public Works TV, we'll give Old Lefty its day in the spotlight. See you on the other side. It's uh, become a somewhat of an icon. It's had some uh, Hollywood moments of itself. Uh, some people might think it's, it's not beautiful, but to me, it's a, it really is a beautiful thing. The Third Street Bridge, it was opened in 1933. It's one of the four drawbridges located in the city and county of San Francisco. Designed by Joseph Strauss, the Third Street Bridge is an example of a Strauss Trunnion Vascule Bridge. It is eligible for listing on the National Register of Historic Places and it is a designated San Francisco landmark. There was a time in the early 1900s when this was, you know, a major part of the port of San Francisco. And there were big ships that used to come in here. It, originally it was a double drawbridge like so that it had to be uh, rebuilt to handle all the traffic and the heavy trains uh, that used to run up and down the Embarcadero here. The railroad company at that time said, listen, we'll kick in some money if you'll rebuild this bridge. And that was good for everybody, so that's exactly what happened. The Third Street Bridge is a major arterial for those who are trying to get from downtown to Mission Bay and back. The bridge also makes up part of the Blue Greenway, otherwise known as the Bay Trail, and is heavily used by pedestrians and bicyclists. It supports five lanes of traffic, as well as pedestrian and bicycle use. The bridge is approximately 200 feet long and 86 feet tall. Its bascule, or lift span, weighs approximately 700 tons. The lift span is counterbalanced by two concrete counterweights, at the north end of the bridge that weigh a combined 1,100 tons. The bridge is currently lifted for marine traffic approximately 400 times per year. Lefty Old Duel was a very popular baseball player. In 1969, they, they renamed this bridge in his honor. In 1999, the Third Street Bridge underwent a major seismic retrofit to bring the bridge's performance to modern design code. At that time, a new operator's tower was constructed, while the historic watchmen's and operator's houses were preserved. It's a really elegant engineering design, and it's a thing of beauty to see it go. It really is. And it can go up pretty quickly. I've seen it go up in 30 seconds or less. It does almost no lifting. It's just over, the motors just overcome friction. So the purpose of the counterweight is to provide, if you will, a counterbalance for the bridge so that the motors and the brakes don't have to work so hard to lift the drawbridge. The bridge has been in service for nearly 85 years now. So as you can imagine, a number of issues have developed over the years. Uh, we're currently working on a major rehabilitation project for it. Uh, we recently completed repair work on the concrete counterweights. Uh, later this summer, we should kick off a, a much larger project, which will include replacement of the open grid steel decking, clean and recoat much of the existing steel below the bridge deck, as well as clean and spot paint bridge truss members above the deck, and much more, all while maintaining or preserving the existing look of the current bridge. It really is a marvelous uh, example of elegant, engineering in a functional way. Is it a thing of beauty? Well, I think it is. 